Hello, y'all. All right. I am here because I got some new dolls. Let me get some of the things out. I have portal pockets. Don't judge. Both of these dolls I got at Walmart. They are part of my Descendants collection. Oh. If you're wondering what I'm wearing. I'm wearing um, a jacket that I'm upcycling. If anybody watches Thomas Sanders, I'm doing... I'm a version of... I'm doing Virgil's jacket. And I just felt like wearing it. Because... I love Rachel. <laughs> but I'm gonna go in and get onto my video. Oh, um, Squeaky and Rocky. Yep, because why not? Uh, Turtle Light's back. Yay. See, Turtle Light. Hey. Where is it? There it is. We just got back from the store, so I'm tired. I need some energy. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna do um, something that I got today. I found this awesome like Sleepy Hollow book. I'm sure it's like Sleepy Hollow and other tales. So I cannot wait to read this. It is by, who is it by? Washington Ivering? Ivering? I, I think I'm saying that right. The artwork is exquisite. I love the artwork. It's so beautiful. It has. How many pages does it have? I don't know. How many? What? Wait a minute. I've just got this book, so I'm a little foggy with it. I want to say it has uh, 330 pages, so, and it's made of like this imitation leather, and it's like really cool, I really like it. Looks like a spell book. <laughs> so, there's that book. Now, you're here to, um, for my doll reviews, so, I'm gonna do Uma first. I ended up getting the, hang on, I ended up getting the Cotillion Uma. I'm really, I'm sorry, but I think out of all the Descendants 2 dolls, this one has got to be my favorite. Oh, look, look my hair head is on me face. <laughs> all right, I'm going to start off. Ow, hot. That's hot. That'd be hot. Hot, hot. All right, I'm going to start off with, let me see something. Oh, can't see me now. All right, I'm going to start off with the doll, something really quick. Um, it's pretty much the same Irma doll, maybe just a little bit of hint of makeup, her, um, brown eyes, and just a tiny hint of makeup. I love her hair, because they actually were decent enough to put little strips of braids in her hair, up in this gigantic bun. See, it's like cut here. Perfectly straight here. Alright. And it has, she has, like, this little crown, like, piece, hair piece. So I think that's really cute that they added that. Ah, her earrings look like, like, little tentacles. Hang on, let me get, let me get the turtle light up in here. See, the little earrings look like they have, like, tentacles. So I think that's, like, really cool that they added that detail. And they have, like, a little shell with it as well. Let me put it back in your ear. But all you have to do is pushed it like any other other dolls <sighs> okay her bracelet i l absolutely love this bracelet let me take off and oh goodness yeah the hands are hard to get off like <laughs> with these um with these certain dolls but her bracelet is legitly an octopus it's so cool it's like the tentacles are wrapping around in, like a bracelet it's so cool. I've never seen anything like that before. So there's her bracelet. Ah, let me put that over there. Put that right here. Ah. I'm going to review her purse next. Ah. If I can get it off her hand. Come on. Uma, give me your purse. Give me your purse, Uma. Thank you. Ah. 
All right, here's our purse. I find this purse beautiful. It has she shells all over it. It's like a teal and like um gold. It's got she shells all over it and starfish and pearls and stuff like that. So I think this is like a very, very, very beautiful little purse. It has three different size starfish and it's like in like a bubble form, so it's really cool. <clears throat> all right, I'm gonna show y'all her shoes. I absolutely love her shoes. Her shoes are black and gold. They have starfish all over them, like things from the sea. And it has a skull back here on the heel and seahorses and lots and lots of shells. See, there's like, there's like props to her mother, Ursula. The black part of the shoe has tons of like little cuts out, cutouts. I can turn the light so you can see. See, there's like little cuts out of different shapes and stuff. And it has like little buckles on top and all that. So I think these are really cool. Um, I don't think it matters what foot you put it on. So that's a good thing. Now I'm going to get into her dress. I absolutely love this dress. It's a teal. Um, it's got, it's teal. It's, and it's gold and glittery it has one, two, three, four, five. it has five layers of frills and this is what it looks like up underneath it if you're wondering so there's like this other like silk imitation like silk up underneath it and this is all like mesh and stuff like that so it starts off with like glitter streaks. Um, it does another layer of glitter streaks. And then it goes into um, a yellow, like this yellow with like glitter spots all over it. And then it does another um, streak of glitter, glitter streaks. And then it gets into the top. This top has no glitter in it, but it has like a ton of like gold detailing like an an anchors and flowers and stuff like that that you'd see um in the ocean she has a teal belt and the top of her dress is like it's like different patterns all over it like squiggly patterns and stuff and like a shiny like metallic type of fabric she is wearing gloves black long gloves but when i I will post a complaint. When I first got her, the gloves, I just did open her and the gloves did start coming off. So I wasn't too happy with that. But other than that, I think this Irma is like my favorite out of all of them. Oh, and if you're wondering how to get the dress on and off, you just unvelcro it in the back. All right, I'm going to get on to another doll that I, that I just got today. I'm not too happy with this one. Actually, I'm not happy with it at all. It's not a good doll. I wouldn't recommend it. But I had to get it to complete my collection. Well, my collection isn't complete. I still have a, um, a variant two-pack and a Dizzy to collect. And then all my Descendants dolls will be collected. Alright, I'm going to start off with her. This is the, um... Like, the Oridon Mal. I don't even think it had a name. I don't even think it had a name in the stores. So this, she was like chilling out with all the other Descendants dolls. So I'm like, it's a Target exclusive. I got her for $25, like the Uma. It's good, that's good Pepsi. Oh, and if you're wondering how much the book was, the book was $10. Over at Walmart. No, I'm not happy with this doll. I mean, the doll's fine, but the out this outfit is what I'm mostly not happy with. As you can see, it's just a normal, like, blue little outfit until you go to the back. Boom. That's all it is. It's just a little strip of Velcro. That is what's holding this skirt onto this dress. It's just this piece of little Velcro here. Be back. 
Sorry about that, you guys. I thought my mom fell. But as you can see, special guest appeared by my idiot brother Chihuahua thing. He's like, quit hitting me. This is Toto. And he, he's back. I think he's done a video with me one time, I think. Not too sure, but I decided, hey, I'm gonna yoink the dog. You smell like Fritos. Whew, dog. No! Get off of her! But, um, I'll start off. Stop sniffing everything! Ah, I'll kick you out! Do you want to be kicked out? Yes? Well, too bad! Alright! <laughs> I gotta get me something to drink. This is mine. Mm. Okay, you're out. Go down, idiot. Good boy. Uh, that's the dog. Uh. All right, I'm gonna start. Jeez, dog! Shoo! Shoo, shoo! Ugh. Can't stand that thing. All right, here's her um skirt. Um. Oh, right. Um. Sorry. Um. This doll does come with two outfits, so. So I'm gonna preview both of them. I forgot that it came with two. I'm tired, people. I didn't. We had some helicopters fly over her last night. It, it, like, at each hour of the night, one helicopter would fly by. And then we're so loud, it sounded like they were fixing it. Sorry about that, I am back. The rotisserie chicken got left in the car. <laughs> Just my luck. But yeah, helicopters came through in like every hour of the night. So it was really stressful for me. And I didn't sleep a wink, so I'm... <laughs> I'm sleep deprived. <laughs> All right, back to the review. This dress is like a really like thin material. I'm just like flap, 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 flap. It's a thin material. I don't think Hasbro's ever used such a thin material for an outfit before. Cause usually they're like using like the heavy material, but I've never seen them use such light. And you can see like right slap through it. See, look. So you can see like right through it. I mean, I can read through this book. I can read that book through it. But it is a, like, baby blue. It has a lot of, like, white detailing to it. Like, stitching details and darker colors. And then this little um, emblem here. I think it's supposed to represent dragon. I think. No, it's just like an emblem. A little gold emblem. So I think that's really pretty. It's got lines and this squiggly line is supposed to um, represent another layer, but they decide not to put that. So it comes into um, darker squiggles and then this like, like see-through mesh type thing. It's like really pretty. It's like a frill at the bottom. So I find that really pretty. I mean, it's, I'm not going to say that Hasbro did bad. It's just like I was not expecting it to just have that little strip of Velcro. I thought it was like a full blown outfit. All right, here's the top to that. It's the same color, same white detailing, except at the top it's um like um if I can find my um oh, my other Uma, I have another Uma. Let me see if I can find my other Uma and I'll be back. All right, I found her. <laughs> Alright, you see how there's like this purple meshy stuff up here at the top of her? That's what this at the top is supposed to mimic. But it's cloth, it's not really that meshy stuff. So it's like a tan color. And it's got the blue detailing, little tiny holes, and a large strip of Velcro in the back. Now this outfit does show Mal's stomach. It will show her stomach. I'll put it on her and show y'all. Because it does show her stomach really bad. I, I wasn't actually expecting it to show her stomach. But the next outfit I absolutely adore. It's so pretty. 
But if you're looking for a dress that is exactly like the movie, he, um, this doll's outfits aren't actually grammatically correct. Alright, see what I'm saying? It shows her stomach. I mean, and that kind of caught me off guard. Here's the shoes that go with this outfit. I think they're like something Lonnie would wear. Oh, I dropped it. They're like really squishy, so they're like easy put on. See how squishy these things are? You can like legitly squish them. But they have one like heel part where you can put the heel on. And the heel, I love the heel. See? The heel is like really swirly and stuff. It's got a lot of detail in it. <clears throat> Sorry, there's her shoe. I'll show you how to pull these things to put on her. Sorry, I'm doing it um, backwards pretty much. There we go. Just this easy slip on. Now, I'm going to go over the doll really, really quick. I love this mouth. She's a really pale. I noticed that she's a bit paler than she usually is. I haven't. I, I wasn't sure what to think of that when I first seen it. But she's still pretty much the same mobile now as she's always been. Alright, her face is still really pale. Except she has blush on. Let me think a hint. Yeah, she has like some um eyeshadow. Not eyeshadow. Yeah, eyeshadow around her eyes with her. Her eyes are brown. They are brown. They are not hazel. They are brown. Whoa. Her eye, um, her eyebrows are brown as well, and her lips are like this really, what color are they? Like a peachish color. Now I love her hair. It's like this really, really like whitish blonde hair, and it comes back into like this tie back here. But then there's this purple up underneath it. Let me see if I can show y'all that. And then the, this purple is like a lavender, and it's so beautiful. I love it so much. It really makes it pop. Alright, I'm going to show y'all her uh, earrings. Alright, here's her earrings. Let me get the turtle lamp in here. Oh no, I dropped it. Eh, got hold by the head. Here's her earrings. They're like hearts. And they are they have like hearts on them. And like little jewels. They're a light. They're um, a lighter. Wait, are they a lighter or are they a darker? Hang on. Hang on. I, I just got this mouse, so I'm not really sure how. How to review her. They're a lighter blue than, than the dress. So, and all you do is push it in her little hole that she has in her um, face. Now, here's her next outfit. I really like this outfit. Um, it reminds me of a bridal outfit for some reason. But it's like this beautiful white dress. It's got um, square glitter strips on it. I wasn't expecting it to have square glitter strips. Here, let me do that. As you can see, there are like these bubble textures. Let me see if I can get something to point out. I know I had some bobby pins up here. Oh, well, I'll just use a needle. I gotta bring this a little bit closer. Ah, well, look at there, my lamp. All right, see, there's like bubbles. Like little teeny bubbles all around the dress. So I think that's really And then there's like these um really white details. They're like more white details up through here. Like circles and lines and all that. And then a really white like silky belt. Oh, the dress is hot now. <laughs> and if you're wondering how it slipped, you can put it on her. It's Velcro as well. Alright, there was, like, a couple extra accessories with this one. First, I'll start out with this bracelet. I believe this was Audrey's bracelet at one point in time. Because it does not look like something Mal would wear. But it is white. And it has, like, these little, like, frilly things on it. Let me see if I can get my the turtle lamp up in here. See the little frilly thingies? 
and it has flowers all over it, and it's like a coil. So there's her bracelet. Oh, and the bracelet coils are like pearls. They look like little pearls. So there's the. Here's the necklace. The necklace is. Let me get comfortable here. I've been walking in stores all day. My headphones are. Uh, her necklace is um white, and it's got like all these insane like details and stuff like that. Here's what her necklace looks like. It's got so much detail, it's insane. Like, I don't even think my camera's picking up. My phone's even picking up how much detail it is. See, there we go. I mean, look at all that detail, it's insane. Alright, and last but not least for this um review, I'm going to be showing her shoes. Her shoes are exactly the same as... That one mouth that I showed earlier, except they're, um, a white. So, I'm not going to really review these, since I already have. They're pretty much the exact same shoes, except I feel like they're harder. I'm not sure, but I feel like they are. So, if you want to go see these shoes reviewed, go to my last video. Well, that is two dolls reviewed and one book. I hope you guys enjoy this like I have, and I hope you have a lovely day, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, y'all.